I'm in Eastern Oregon at the entrance to Mallier Cave. It's May 18th, 2022. I'm at one of their annual open houses. They have a open houses three weekends a year. This is their second out of three for this year. I'm the first one here besides the people who work here or you know, the owners. They got a gas generator running. That's what's making all the noise. It'd be nice if they didn't, but oh well. <laughs> they didn't ask me. <laughs> anyway, I just want to show the entrance to the cave here. It's got a cool... I just want to notice on the rocks here. Notice these rocks are drier, not covered in moss. These other rocks here, they're older, covered in moss. Some of them are covered in writing too. Ugly. Let's see if I can go around here. Do my first lap here. I already signed the waiver so I can go in. says that the whole cave is about half a mile long 3523.29 feet yeah that's what I was thinking so notice there's a nice big steel door here gate gate dedication grand lodge blah 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 interesting no trespassing burn lodge 97 Oh cool, there's a bird nest. A couple of bird nests up here. Oops, dang it, my stoop. There we go. Ah, that's an improvement. Got a couple of small bird nests up here. Oh yeah. What the swallows those? love it. Oh yeah. well, they got babies. You see that? They got oh, beaks. Yeah. I'll try not to bug them. I just want to show they them on the babies, camera. Gene. Yep. There's baby birds up here. That's got cool. A couple of them right here. You know, it's yep. funny. I saw. I stopped in Burns yesterday. I stopped at the uh, what's it called? The uh, Historical museum. Oh, yeah, Th there's a bat in their little um, shed where they keep old vehicles <laughs> A real bat. It was so big. I thought it was fake. So I asked them is that thing real? They're like holy cow. They didn't even know about it either. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's cool oh. I mean, yeah, there's a, a lot of a lot of birds down in here. So. Okay. It used to be a lot oh, more. Earth. They go all the way down. You can see those two. Okay So they'll go way any down. bats in fact, that's why we built the uh, the uh, fence, the oh, the gap on the top. Or? Yeah, I left that open cool. for the birds. But you, you don't know if there's any bats or uh, just yeah, birds. Bats in here now. Cool. I've never seen any in this cave. There's some other caves that I've seen them in. Okay, I'll keep my eyes open. So. I'm gonna go take a look around. Oh. I'll be back. <laughs> <laughs> well, enjoy yourself. I yeah. know you will. Yeah. Well, I got all day. Oops. Here's another bird. Yeah, oh, that's a rock. <laughs> Weird. Looks like a piece of metal, rusted piece of metal. Interesting. Notice all the white spots on the floor. Okay. Huh. I swear it looks different from last time. Like, I don't know if it's wetter or drier or what. I think the last open house was a week ago or a month ago. So it's been a while since anybody's been in here. Wow. Let's see how my video is doing. Well, it's picking up something. Oh, wow. Yeah. Usually in a floor like this, dirt, just like outside, if it's, it's dry, it's light colored. And if it's wet, it's dark colored. So the color of the floor tells you how wet it is. As you can see in here, it's uneven because it, it doesn't rain in here, obviously. It's got a roof slash ceiling. But, uh, so it comes out uneven. So there's the way in. My only way out. If they lock me in here, I'm screwed. <laughs> anyway.
in here. Uh, I would say the ceiling's at least a couple dozen feet tall. The cave is dozens of feet wide. Ooh, let me, I think I already showed this last time. Check it out. They have electrical wiring now so they can run a generator at the entrance to the cave and then have uh, electricity all the way in. I'm surprised they don't install some solar panels. That'd be kind of cool. But whatever. I'm going to stick to the left. I already came through here last year, sticking to the right. So I want to do the same thing or, you know, do the reverse. But notice here, the floor is a little bit uneven. So there's like a six foot drop off. It's a lot wetter on the left. Like there was a creek over here on the left. It's been raining in Burns, but um, it looks like it hasn't rained here in a while. So I was actually hoping there'd be water flow. But in fact, I think there's forecast for thunderstorms. But yeah, no such luck. Oh, uh, well. Hmm. Look at the ceiling, though. How bright and shiny it is. It's probably cave slime growing. Notice it grows very unevenly. It grows wherever certain conditions, like nice and bright, nice and wet. Or not bright, it becomes bright wherever it's wet or white, bright nutrients. Wow. Well, they're starting up that generator again. That thing is so noisy. They should put some solar panels. I think I'll propose that on the way out. They got tons of land here and it's sunny here like 11 and a half months a year. This would be like the perfect place for solar panels. They're probably worried the solar panels would get vandalized or stolen. Not a lot of people out here to guard the valuables. Mm. Hmm. Notice there's tire tracks here in the mud. I didn't do it. Hmm. Interesting. Some kind of stick. Not sure what that is. All right, so here's the part where the masons have their meeting. There's the mystery door there. Oh, I see, the lighting is starting to work. Check this out. <laughs> Boy, this is creepy. It's like the only light here is from these uh, extension cords being plugged into each other. So there's just a little bit of glow. It's a pair of orange, like uh, eyes in the dark. Ooh. Oh, dang it, my gimbal's being stupid. Hang on. My gimbal's being picky. It's not as young as it used to be. The battery. I don't know what the heck. My gimbal's just wearing out. I've had it a couple of years. Excuse me. Great, I just inhaled a bug. All right, there's the mystery door. Got a handle and everything, but you can't lock it. I guess that means we can get in and out all we want. There's more electrical wiring here. So you can see they got metal bleachers set up. They used to have wooden bleachers, but the bleachers got all moldy and gross. Wow, there's a nice ladder here. I should ask them if I could play with that. <laughs> set it up. You know, now that I think about it, maybe I really should ask them if I can. Yeah, I'm gonna be here a while, so I got time to ask them some dumb questions. I wanna go over here behind the bleachers, but look how muddy the floor is. This is really messed up. So you know what, I think I'm going to skip going behind the bleachers this time. Maybe I'll go up on the bleachers. I signed a waiver 